What's going on YouTube? Welcome to Georgia. It's been nine months. Donkeys. So it's been nine months since the last time that I dropped a video and it's due to a lot of reasons. A lot of reasons, some of those being we did relocate. Uh, we moved to Georgia back in June and I sold the business in Montana. So basically, I kept the brand, so I still have Mountain Town Detail, but I did sell the business in Montana, and I haven't started it back up. And those reasons being just the whole relocation process and everything that brings. Um, but we've been settled in now to our new home uh, for about three months now. When I say settled, <laughs> I mean we moved in. Settled, not yet. That's due to a lot of reasons as well. One of those being what this video is about, and that is building on to our home that we just bought and building on a brand new garage. So that way, hopefully, in the near future, maybe March, April, I'll be able to start detailing again um, a little by little, I guess. So we moved to Jasper, Georgia. I don't know, most of you guys probably don't know, but if you do, cool. If you don't, here's a little history. Jasper, Georgia is the first mountain city in Georgia. It's nicknamed Mountain City. Now, there is a Mountain City, Georgia, which is up North Georgia, the very top of the state line, but um, Jasper was actually called Mountain City first, I do believe. And then another cool thing is Mountain Town, Creek runs through LJ, Georgia, which is the next city over from Jasper. So that's really neat that Mountain Town actually has followed me and actually represents a lot of stuff here as well. So that's great. But right now we're just uh, walking on our property. I'm walking up towards the house right now to where I can show you what we're going to be building on, how we're going to be building on, and all the goods. So let's check that out. So as you can see as we're walking up here, there's a lot going on. They have already started the process of concrete. They've got most of the pre-work done. There's a few things they still need to do, but for the most part, pretty much done. So the main things here is we had this garage here already there. Well, why do you need another garage? Well, this one was just a little bit small for me. This one was, uh, the garage door itself was only 16 wide, and I think only seven feet tall, which was very small, and I couldn't get my vehicles in the garage. And, like, depth and width was 21 feet. So 21 feet that way, 21 feet across, um, and inside the garage. So just like, I don't know, not a lot of room to actually detail or do anything in there. I mean, I could, but I'm, just, I'm used to about, you know, my previous garage was around 650, and then this one's only, I think it was 400. However, let's come on to into the new addition, the garage. Um, the old garage was actually going to be turned into livable space, so bathroom, bedroom, pantry, stuff like that. So basically, when you walk out of this addition, when it's built, there'll be a door, a man door here. You'll walk out into the garage. And then inside the garage here, there's two things. So this right here will be another door. So that beam is the backside of the actual main garage. And then there'll be a door here. This door opens up into this room. So this room here is about a 10 by 10. 16 I think it is and that's actually going to be a another storage garage I guess and there actually will be a garage door on the back side of here as well for like lawn mowers four wheelers stuff like that this over here will just be a concrete slab you know grill you know whatever else we decide to put there and then this will just be storage and stuff like that as we come across over here there will be the man door, which will be right here. And then this will have an upstairs on it as well. And there will be stairs right here that go up to the upstairs portion. Let 
And as far as the front of the house goes, garage door here, garage door will be 18 by nine. The total garage is actually gonna be 24 across, 30 in depth. So it's gonna have a good bit more space. I think the total square footage of it will be around 700. The door that comes out here, and then you'll have the stairs here, and then it'll go up to a 13 by 10 room upstairs where my office will be. I'll have a window here that will overlook everything out front, um, but I'll be able to do a lot more in here just due to how big it will be and how open it's gonna be. As we walk over here, there will be a, another man door here, I believe. It might be on that side. I believe it's here though that you can come in the garage from the outside. This area right here will actually come out a little bit. So I have like a little bump out from the inside. That just gives a little extra room on that. That'll do it for this one guys, but stay tuned for step two, which will be coming next week. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, like this video and follow along. See you guys.